What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. We brought the Shelby out today. We are at a toy drive slash car show. There is a ton of cars here. It's being hosted at the UTI down in Long Beach. Um, we got here a little early. They just let us in. There is like a ton of people coming. There's a whole lineup outside. Everybody's waiting to come in right now. It's pretty sick. I'm glad we got a spot already with the show car casing. Um, there's gonna be some SEMA cars here, whatnot. So stay tuned guys, you do not wanna miss out. Hey guys, let's check it out. Let's walk around a little bit. We got our parking spot. Wide body Corolla. Oh, that is clean. And we have a really clean Teggy right here. I think this is an all motor build. It looks like it. This is very nice. Got the cage. Not a Honda fan, but this is nice. I like it a lot. All right, guys. So here we have a Rocket Bunny MX-5 Miata. It's the first time I've ever seen one of these. You guys are all familiar with the Rocket Bunny kits on the 350Zs, but I have never seen one on a MX-5. Like, this is actually really cool. He's got the carbon bride seat. Oh, they're not carbon, but he's got the bride seats, carbon interior. This Rocket Bunny kit is just so nice. It looks so good. When this thing pulled in, it looked like a mini RX-7. I know. It's cool. I really like it, though. Very clean RX-7. You guys have seen this one before. This was like a long time ago. I want to say it was like at... God, it was probably at one of like the Origins car shows or something in Irwindale. It's got carbon seats. He's got everything. There's, there's too much... Literally too much to list on this car. Thing's sick. Very clean S14. I like these Brahm seats a lot. Only thing is they're white. I would get them dirty hella fast. This interior is actually really nice. I like it. This whole car was clean. When I pulled up, okay, so it is wrapped because I could see the, the sticker underneath it, but very nice wheels. Got a FRS. I guess these things depreciate a lot nowadays. What in the... Mustang! BMW 540i. This guy was actually in front of us when we pulled in. Then you got the Swang Stang. I'm just kidding. You got my uh, Shelby here. RX-8 that pulled in next to me. There's a lot of stuff going on with this thing, I noticed when I was walking around and looking at it, but we're not gonna get into that. He's so fucking cute, dude. Ooh, he's so soft. He's so soft. What's up, buddy? Hi. Hi, Sam. You don't want to head up? Hi, bud. I can't do this. <laughs> Guys, look at the little antenna on this thing. That is so funny. Oh, here he goes, here he goes. He is cruising. Yeah, guys, there's a lot of cool cars. Oh my god. You know, you know you got a fast boy? When you got a hole in the headlight. This is so cool. This is so cool. Guys, I would still love to have an Evo. Preferably an Evo 9. That would be like my dream of an Evo to buy. Be really cool, but yeah, I, I like this thing a lot. You guys all know I love Evos. Cars are timeless. Another 240, we have another RX-7. Oh my God, I didn't even notice this one. That is clean, we'll get to that one in a second. I like the red Recaros in this thing, it's pretty nice. Gauge pods are good, oh. Okay, this is actually a really nice interior on this one. I do like it a lot. This one, 
It's very simple. You guys can see the simplicity compared to this one. I like both of them. I just, I kind of think I like this one better though on the interior wise, but I do like this red. I love me and my red cars. You guys all remember Tut. He's got that crazy bagged, everything done to a 5.0 that you can possibly think of. Boy, he's got a Christmas tree back here. Jeez. <laughs> That's crazy. Interior is pretty sweet too on this one. Here we have Bumblebee. I feel like this is just what everybody does. Just buy a Camaro and give it the whole Transformers theme. Yeah, it's cool. I dig it. But I feel like this is kind of a, a played out thing already. Like everybody does the whole Bumblebee thing. Which, I'm not hating on it. I'm just saying... I kind of want to see a little more originality from these Camaro owners, you know what I'm saying? New Type R, I really like these new Type R's a lot. I honestly, guys, would get one if it was an all-wheel drive car. I just can't justify myself paying forty-five, you know, $50,000 out the door, and in the end of the day, it's just a front-wheel drive Civic. But the interior on these things are nice. I do like these cars a lot, don't get me wrong. Not hating, I just wish it was all-wheel drive. So I actually saw this one pull up earlier. We're gonna take a minute, breathe it in guys, smash that like button while you're at it, hit the subscribe, and, and now let's check out this FD. V-mount, single turbo, the, oh, just everything. I wonder if it's bridge ported. That's so clean. The blue, or blue, the blue on red. The wing, everything on this car is perfect. It's not like overdone. It's tasteful in my opinion, and it's perfect. So I like this one a lot. I give this one a 10. We have the JDM Legends. And then you go, oh, GTR. It's so crazy seeing like this turned into this. Inline six. V6. Hey, this manifold though, this thing be bustin' bustin'. Look at that. Yeah, that looks good. And I just changed the coolant tank and I think it looked really good, you know? Excuse me, can you back up to my car? 9, 10. I think it started at, at what time? Look who showed up. Started at what time? It started at 8. It said that we roll in at 8. Hold on, let me, let me fact check that. What time does it say? It says it started at 8. Start at eight? Yes. Eight o'clock. Show cars, eight o'clock. Nine o'clock spectators. Cars. Yes, we are cars. in the show. But not like I usually do. Just like you wanted to be. We are in the show. I'm not in the show, I'm eight over there. Guys, red on red crime we have going on here. Oh my goodness. This is really clean. I love the attention to detail on this one. This is really nice. And I'm not like a huge S2K fan. It is boosted, guys. I see a, see a blow up valve right there. There is a turbo in here somewhere. That's pretty sick. Oil filter's right there, down. That's crazy. Look at this one. All motor. What are these guys? Please tell me in the comment section. Is this a, is this a B18 motor? I don't know. I don't know my Hondas. So I don't know much about Hondas, guys, but I'm pretty sure that means you got deep pockets, right? Spoon. Damn, look at the look at the chrome on that. Oh, you're good, man. This thing is so clean. Damn, look at the chrome polish on that. Godspeed. I've seen a lot of those uh, fuel rails on people's cars. Damn guys, look at that. That is so sick. Oh my god. Didn't even notice that. I like this. Look at this. Look at this. That is so cool. That's funny. Very clean. Very clean. So I guess everybody likes those top mount intercoolers. I personally like to go front mount. Alright, and here we have the tree huggers section. Everybody with it. Wait, yo, is this bike shortened? What the? Here. Dude, why? Is this 
just like a thing now? Like, let's just everybody, let's all just go hug trees. I'm kidding. We have the Subi gang over here. Fun fact, guys, I used to have a bug eye just like that one. Just like it. The, this car looks 10 times better than this car, in my opinion. These front ends are hideous. Absolutely hideous. Ask me some questions, I might get them right. Ask you some questions, you might get them right. All right, what is this one right here? I don't even know. Oh, okay. All right. We're, we're going to cut that one. All right, Isaiah. Isaiah. Toyota Supra. Okay. Okay. Isaiah, this one right here. What is this one? Mm, Supra. Okay. What gen? MK4. MK4. All right. What is this one right here? The white one? Supra MK5. MK5? Yep. What's next to it? It's kind of a clapped out Mustang, but it's okay. It's very, it's, it's very old. Okay. What is this one right here? This is a this is a Corona. This is a. I don't even know the year of this thing. Oh, it's a drift car. Look at the little handbrake inside. You see the the hydro brake? Oh yeah, I know that. It's cool, huh? You want to know something? I've seen a handbrake. Guys, look at this snail. That's sick. Yeah, it's a little drift machine. This thing is so badass. I would have so. Oh, it's got the forged carbon dash. Damn, this interior is pretty nice. A little bit more to work on, but this thing is pretty nice. 510. Oh my god, I didn't even see this guy's 510 four door. Prefer a two door, but still looks really clean. So I thought this guy had TEs on it for a second, but it's not. The fitment's actually pretty nice on this. This guy's wings way bigger than mine. Same same APR though. Looks good. Looks like he tracks it, maybe. I don't know. Maybe he just canyons. I have no idea. Are these T? No, they are. Oh, oh, oh. That actually looks pretty good. Very low key. Guys, I don't really know what this car is, but I'm gonna block it right here for a minute. You guys see that? <laughs> the attention to detail today is wild, but I think this is a Prius. I don't. I think it's a Prius. Yeah, this is a, yeah, it's a Prius. Okay, all right, okay. I just, we, you know, we had to confirm, guys. We had to confirm. Oh, man. Oh, dude, that's so clean. Low quality footage right now, but. That's so sick. Fresh Kicks has the same one in uh, his Z. I was just looking at that. All right, so we just finished talking to the owner that actually did this K24 swap. With the six, I think he said it was a 6277 turbo on it, but this is just such a cool swap on this FRS right here. He said it's making about 550, 560 wheel, but that is a very, very cool swap. Fun, reliable, it's got a full Gretty on it. But yeah, he's got it set up so it can make right around 750 on the next setup that's going inside of it. So, can't wait to see that. Cheers to you, dude. All right, guys, check out this Datsun 510 four-door. I didn't realize how clean it was until I got up to it. But, I mean, everything, top to bottom. You got the two-piece Willwood brake kit on top of here with the rotors, little carbon fiber accents on it. Interior is fully redone. You guys can't really see it from here, but this car top to bottom is immaculate. And you guys all know I am a huge Dotson fan. I prefer a two-door, but this is nice. Good job, sir. Good job. Uh, it's close. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> this is nice. Look at the BBS's on this thing. Proper, proper wheels for a car like this. C63. This thing's nice. Oh my god. This guy balled out with the carbon. I don't even know what kind of seats these are. Like where it came out of. They're AMG seats. Are they? Are these stock like this, guys? Somebody comment down below and let me know. What the? Here we got the uh, Mercedes lineup. Look at these BBSs. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. 
What is this like? All the whack? What? The <laughs> These cars are so big. Oh my god! Speaking of big cars, this actually has a lot of space. But I mean, I feel like you're sitting like 10 feet away from your driver. Like my goodness, it's a cool wing on top of here. Very, very dirty car, sir. But I like it. I take the red off the mirrors. That is, that is not it. I've actually seen this car like a lot. I think you guys remember it in the vlogs, but a little, a little, a little look see, little cage in the back, fire extinguisher. Yeah, we've seen this one before. It's clean. I like it. I like this orange. I'm not sure if it's a wrap or not, but I do like this. Oh yeah, a nose attack. It's got to be a wrap, right? And here we have this uh, very, very, very nice Acura NSX. I'm just kidding. <laughs> this is clean though. All right, guys. Here we have the Evo. But before that, we're gonna check out this Lotus Elise. My, fun fact guys, my old instructor when I went to school like 10 years ago, he had a Lotus Elise and we were like, Eddie, how do you afford all this cool stuff? He's like, well guys, I'm not married and I have no kids. So if you guys want to afford all this stuff, just don't get married, don't have kids, um, you know? You can be lonely or you can be happy with your cars, it's one or the other, I don't know, it's up to you guys. <laughs> This is cool though. I don't know about that. Oh, it's a case, but yeah, look at all the carbon on here. Oh my goodness. Check out the hood, guys. This is the cool part. That is so sick. Badass. You don't want to go on the bike? No, because I don't have balance. So I'm going to put you on this bike. Check it out. You don't have what? I don't have balance. You don't have balance? <laughs> it's okay. We'll teach you. This thing is so cool, guys. What? Yeah, That's cool. sick. All right, you guys remember this race car in the last one. We two weekends in a row, guys. What? I think, I think this is for rocks to fly out. Maybe I don't know. I have no idea. This thing's pretty cool looking though. So this is a pretty big event. I'm actually pretty hungry. I want to get some food here, but I also do want to go sit down like at a restaurant somewhere and have a nice breakfast. I think that'd be cool. But there's a lot of Teslas here today, guys. Look, we got GT3 RSs, Ferraris, a lot of RX-7s today too, I've noticed. I've actually seen this, uh, I think it's an actual Hellcat, I'm not sure. I've seen it before though. Things nice. So apparently a lot of these cars were SEMA cars. I mean, they look like it. But yeah, a lot of these cars on this side are all SEMA builds. Damn, look at this thing. That thing's sick. That is nice. Not a fan of the yellow Recaros, but this is a cool car. I bet it's a fun one to drive for sure. That's a Vino. So what are you gonna get? I don't really know. You know what you want? Wait, over there there's Fast and Furious. Fast and Furious? Okay. MK5. Oh, this is the one that guy was telling me about. Wow. That is clean. That is definitely, definitely a SEMA car for sure. Interior on this thing is pretty sweet. That is so sick. That is such a clean setup. There's so much space under the hood of these things. It's crazy. The titanium. That's cool. On Paxton. Anyways, like I said, guys, we got a Paxton on top of this thing. Looks really cool. I'm not sure if I even got the last video because my battery just died, so we're on the next battery. But we'll go ahead and check out this one right here, MK4. Very, very nice swap. Oh, it's actually not. He still kept the twin turbos on it. That's wild. It's rare to see that, but it's pretty cool. Got an R8 over here. So we got a Starlet. I actually really like these cars. They kind of remind me of like a little Volkswagen Rabbit. Here we have a Mazda. I think it's an RX-3. Yeah, it is. It is. Oh, I love these cars so much. RX-3. Looks like he kept... Oh my god, single turbo. That's sick. Guys, I didn't even see this one. Here is our two-door 510 that I was telling you guys about. 
So sick. All right, so you guys remember this one from the last vlog? We got the GTR over here, Porsche. I believe that's like an M8. I don't know. That music way too loud. These are really cool. These all just pulled up like a little while ago. Pretty tight. This one's pretty cool too. I like the valve cover. That's like a. I don't even know what you would call it, but it's a really cool, uh, like a powder coat, I guess they did to it. Nice carbon Recaros in here. They just look uncomfortable, but they'd probably be fun for like a little drive, you know what I'm saying? Long drives like that, there's just no way you're going to catch me riding or something like that. Clean little S2Ks though. Like I said, too small for me, but cool cars. Alright, here we have some BMW track cars. That's pretty cool. Got it. Probably just a stock motor. I don't know. Looks pretty stock. Intake, header, probably a little tune. Dogs. Another uh, track car. It looks like this one's got a little bit more interior, maybe. Not really. About the same. Probably both very similar setups on these cars. Nice wheels, RX-7 FD, another Porsche, probably a 911 I want to say, I'm not sure. I think this is a GT3. How loud is this car? This is cool. Oh! That's nice, these guys are parked a little too close for comfort. Alright, this one's worth looking at, check this M4 G82 out. <laughs> Lots of carbon on it. Yeah, these are sick. Congrats to you, Mr. Fresh Kicks, who just got one. This is a nice wing, I like it. Yeah, guys, Kicks just bought one, and his is sick. It's like a silver color. Oh, unforged, my guy. Unforged, you should have a warranty still. Go take it back. Have him get you some new ones, my guy. So, so what is it? <laughs> It's trying to, it's beat, it's counting beat 30, 5, 10, 15, 20, 20, 20 30. That's, that's hilarious. That's funny. Yeah, I think that's Alright, Isaiah, out of all these over here, you got this C8, this C8, and then you have the three GTRs. Which is your favorite car out of these five right here? I'm gonna go, the C8 looks nice, but I'm gonna go with the GTR. You're going with the GT, GTR. Yeah. Which GTR though? There's three. Yeah. Which is your favorite one? The one that beat 30 Hellcats, which is this end one over here. It's pretty nice. Yeah, I see these always pull up together. You guys, check out this thing. It's pretty wild. You see the. Oh my god. JC. Now that thing's a crazy car. We gotta go take a look at that, guys. We have to go take a look at this one. That's a 2JZ swap Lamborghini. I believe it's a Huracan. I've seen this thing a lot. You guys probably seen it on TikTok. It's got the biggest turbo he can put on top of this thing. We were watching and the cop did flip the u-turn on him like right as he left so i don't know hopefully hopefully this man didn't get a, a state rep i'm thinking he has different plates i didn't even really look or pay attention maybe he doesn't even have plates on the thing for the show who knows i feel bad for him though that's a really really cool car another clean porsche we got an nsx oh a unmolested NSX in its natural habitat. I like it. I like it. These things are they are so expensive now, guys. There's a lot of Porsches. It's so funny. It's like I swear all the Porsche owners used to own BMWs. It's just like 
upgrading from like a Honda to like something LS, you know? You guys feel me? You guys remember this S2K uh, in last week's vlog? God, this is that carbon exactly. fiber one. Crazy. This one was in last uh, vlog that we had going on. But I think I'm blocked in, guys. It looks to me like I am blocked in. Very, very clean F82. This is that big ass Jeep from uh, earlier that we saw. This thing's huge. Look at those tires on this thing. 42s. Oh my god. All right, as you guys can see, we are no longer at the Cars and Coffee. We went down the street a little bit. I forgot all about this place when I used to live here. There is a cool spot where you can come eat down here in Long Beach right next to UTI, the airport, all that. Okay, all right, buddy. All right, dude. Yeah, you almost took me out, bro. Almost took me out. Nice, city toe, Long Beach, almost took me out. Good shit, brother. I think it's called the Long Beach Exchange. It's been a minute since I've been down here. I used to live down here, but it's pretty cool. There's a lot of food, all kinds of stuff inside of here. But we're gonna eat right now. I am hungry. All right, guys, what did I get? What did I get? A bunch of forks. I did get a bunch of forks. Taquitos? We got some, we got some bomb food over here, right? Yeah. I know, I got some cucumber, lemon, lime water, I think, yeah, I don't know. We got our food. <laughs> I got guys. All right, we just finished eating. Look at this F80, guys. This has to be on bags. There is no way. There is no way that this thing is sitting on the earth on coils. Very clean car though, I will give it that. Very clean car. We are out guys. I think we're gonna go to the mall next. I have no idea what we're doing right now, but I am full. Check out the Christmas tree. Guys, it's Christmas time. Should we do Vlogmas? Maybe? What's up guys? Sorry about earlier, my camera did die so we didn't get to really film much of like an outro or anything like that um my camera died both my batteries died i ended up leaving my camera on i guess but um we tried to go check out some christmas lights afterwards and half the power was out in the neighborhood candy cane lane so it's whatever we're gonna try it again tomorrow but i appreciate you guys thank you so much for watching another video don't forget to comment like subscribe to the channel turn on those post notifications and we'll catch you guys in the next one peace